We've seen and heard many ideas to fix traffic in Metro Manila. What's one more way to consider? In particular, someone is suggesting turning EDSA and C5 into one-way highways. Gerard de la Peña has the story. Traffic along EDSA has been worsening by the day. The Metro Manila Development Authority says average speed along the major thoroughfare currently averages at 19 kilometers per hour, the same speed that motorists experience during Christmas season. One proposal of an engineering firm to make EDSA a one-way road going south paired with C5 which will be made exclusive to northbound vehicles. Engineer Fernando Guevara said this is the conclusion of his year-long study having found out that there are so many people that needs to be moved. He said there must be 54 buses in a given bus stop in an hour. The study has reached transportation authorities but has yet to be acted upon. And which, uh, well, I understand because the mindset nila iba eh. Gusto nila yung mga subway, mga skyway, yung mga um, high-faluting words. Sa akin, okay lang yun. Pero, eventually, if you put a skyway, eventually, you, will you have to deal with the traffic situation below. The study also indicated that there must be a bus stop every 500 meters to make them much more accessible to commuters. There must be a bus system. Kung walang bus system, Wala tayo magagawa. Uh, siguro later pag ginawa na yung mga subway, skyway, standstill na tayo lahat dito. Siguro mag, baka, baka pag kahit na bisikleta, traffic eh. The MMDA said the task on implementing such suggestion is not in its hands as it is merely enforcing existing policies. Hindi pa po tayo makakapag-commit sa ngayon but we really do appreciate ideas like this at least so we have something to start on. Guevara says he has also sent the proposal to Senator Grace Poe, who authored Senate Bill 847 or the Commuters Welfare Act. For News 5, Gerard de la Peña, we are One News.